hello students welcome you all on your pedia education so my dear students as you know isro shortlisted and called for the interview of almost 200 students from the csc background so now my dear students many a times like csc student have a doubt sir which five subject we will consider for the interview see my dear students first of all you have to know like what will be your role and responsibility in isro and we know that it is a space organization space research organization where a csc student can deal with the data analytics part he or she can deal with the image processing with the back end with the front end it means you may have to write the code and then computer network and network security these are the most important domain if i talk about for a particular computer science student see my dear students in computer science in if i go with that gate paper like we almost all the subjects are fundamental or the core subjects that may be algorithm data structure toc computer network coa and operating system dbms and other subject my dear students but keep in mind my dear students specifically for isro the most important subjects are computer network then you can deal with algorithm data structure security and then out of the uh, operating system and dbms you can select one subject maybe you can also select toc fine but the point is other than these subject you also have to prepared some of the allied subject that may be image processing that may be natural language processing that may be basics of data science that may be statistics so and python language so these are some of the important topics or important subject which a csc student must have to prepare even though there is a shortlisted now and we have enough time to prepare for the basics of allied subject as well as as you already crack the written exam that means you have some fundamental concepts in your mind related to the core subject of csc but now my dear students many a times because each and every individual of csc have a dream to do a job in isro to or serve the country in that's why my dear students the point is many of many of times whenever we go for the interview or we face the interview the problem is most of the time students just revise their gate subject see my dear students gate subject are good to crack the written exam but again if you want to join as a scientist or at any position as a computer science background in isro then keep in mind the fundamentals that is fine but you have to know what type of question they may ask and the good thing is you the first thing is you have to know how to deliver your answer how to deliver the answer in the more appropriate beautify manner whenever sometimes they will ask very easy problems related to the only definitions like what is data structure what is algorithm what is db what is like fog what is deadlock what is starvation these are very simple problems what is oops concept what is the main concept of oops what are the four pillars of oops fine so these are some of the important concept or important problems but the point is whenever you are trying to deliver your answer you are answer should be formally correct keep in mind instead of giving a example and then try to explain them that is not the right way my dear students so my dear students this side mukesh sir from the computer science department i'll provide you some of the questions that may be 40 or 50 questions from each and every important subjects what you have to do is you can take these um, pdf download it from the description or you can visit on the your pedia education website where you can easily find out these questions my dear students and then try to prepare the questions and try to give the snap interview and the mock interview as early as possible as much as possible 
and you know that your pedia education is the largest platform of india which provide you the rehearsal of the interviews that is in the form of the mock and in the snap so if you wish to join or if you want to prepare your like interview preparations then you can join our module by your pedia education so my dear students i'll start with some of the questions and this particular video is mainly dedic dedicated to the questions of programming and data structure see my dear students whenever we talk about the programming the first um, doubt comes into the mind sir which language we prefer either c c++ java and python so these are the four most important so i'll suggest you we know that c what the c language is is if you are a bit comfortable with the oops con concept then go with the c++ either you can go with the python but keep in mind my dear students only c is not the sufficient they may ask you question related to the other programming language also so my dear students some of the questions related to the programming and data structure are they may ask you okay you know c language can you just tell me what the what do you mean by a language see my dear students these type of questions or we are not ready with these type of questions okay we don't know how to deliver the answer that's why my dear students suppose that you know c language but you don't know what do you mean by a language then i think in the first question your impression goes down so that's why my dear students please be ready with these type of questions and the second is what is the difference between structure and union we know that structure is a user defined data type so accordingly you have to mention your answer fine the next question is can you just tell me the difference between we have one is data structure and one is file structure fine what is the major difference between file structure and data structure next even though we are not frequently using the concept of enum but still enum is very useful that's why they may ask you the question related to what is enum and what is the use of enum in which type of applications we are going to use enum or union next why array start with zero see this is a type of question where <coughs> they forcefully ask or given give you a hint that hey array always start with the zero but we know that this is not the right answer fine that's why intentionally they ask the question why array start with zero next how python uh, does python have arrays see in python we have list we have tuple we have dictionary we have set and we have numpy fine numpy so data frames we um, then we have some pandas libraries all this stuff that's why they ask you the question do you know that python have array or not next what is the difference between numpy and list which one is faster which one is slower what is the main reason what is the difference between array and linked list see my dear students whenever we go with the data structure the most important part is first of all you have to know the definition of data structure then you have to know different type of data structure then you have to know the comparison between the data structure that may be related to array linked list stack queue tree and graph and the next important problem is you have to know the basic operations time complexity and the last and the most important problem is you have to know the application of each and every data structure that i mean application mean real time applications and you have to know at least 3 to 4 applications of each and every data structure my dear students then we know what is 3 tree but we don't know what is threaded tree in most of the times so this is again a important problem and now my dear student the most important problem is what is malloc calloc reallocate what is the major difference between malloc calloc see what is pointer what is wide pointer what is null pointer what is dangling pointer again pointer is a very important concept what is the use of pointer so what is priority queue how we can implement 
See, we know that we require two stack to implement Q and two Q to implement stack. But are you able, are you in a position to write the abstract code for these, these things? If yes, then you can say that yes, your, prepar your preparation is good. But many a times they may give you a pen and paper and ask you, can you write the abstract code to implement the Q using stack? Then what is the difference between call by value and call by reference difference between stack and memory heap that is again the important problem explain the difference between stack and heap how does C handle multi dimensional array please can you give me an example what is the use of type def what is the purpose of type def keep in mind my dear students again these type of things we are not familiar in our gate syllabus. Provide an example, explain the difference between static and dynamic linking. Linking part is very, very important, my dear students. So please go with this question also. Discuss the concept of recursion. We are familiar with that part. Discuss the role of, that is again uh, one of the important problem. Discuss the role of preprocessor directive in C. And please give me the commonly used directives. Then we know how the C handle memory leakage what is memory leakage and how C handle it. Then we know does Python have pointer concept, what is the end percent or referencing and dereferencing operator in C, what is oops, oops is very important concept my dear students. Many a times if you just google out the previous year experience, you can see that in each and every in interview they may, they ask the question related to oops polymorphism, encapsulation, all these stuff my dear students. What is overloading, overriding, what is function prototype, type def I already discussed, then hash define in C, what do you mean by that, what is the role of header in C, C programming. So my dear students, these are some of the important problems, I just mentioned here 40 problems, but keep in mind, if you prepare, if you give, at, if you prepare at least 10 to 15 problem each and every day and give the snap, take a rehearsal as much as possible, then we can say that yes, you are ready for the ISRO job or ISRO profile. So my dear students, I want to say that yes, in ISRO, some points are very important, your confidence skill, the way you are going to deliver your answer and the knowledge. That's why my dear students, if you want to enhance your introduction part or the, the if you want to beautify your answer, if you want to enhance your confidence, if you want to enhance your um, like, um, like vocab and the how to deliver the answer, then my dear students, I just say you please do more and more practice please do more and more or please give more and more snap that is very very important my dear students that's why my dear students as you know like we are serving from the last seven to eight years specifically for the interview preparation guidance you know that your pedia education is the biggest platform in india which provide you the interview guidance so my dear students if you think that yes you need that guidance so you can register in our module that is isro interview preparation module if you still have any query please visit our your pd education website or you can contact to our executive and you can interact with us call with us or discuss your doubt with us with one to one that is totally free of course so thank you good luck